Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for joining us here today. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, uh, wherever you are joining us from in the world. Uh, and during this busy season, we appreciate you taking that time to spend it with us here today for the first of its kind, the .NET Comp and Visual Studio 2022 launch after party event, where we go and talk with experts and ask the questions that you submitted uh, live here at this event. Um, so I'm incredibly excited to be hosting this event for you all. My name is Jamie Singleton. I'm a senior program manager on the .NET community team. And today I'm joined here with some of my favorite friends from the PM and engineering groups and cloud advocates uh, to talk about everything .NET 6 and VS 2022 launch related. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna bring on all of my friends. Yay, party. Hi. Hello everyone. Hello, hello, hello. The gang's all here. <laughs> Exciting. Thank you all for joining me as well. Um, also, again, close to the end of the year. So I know you're all really busy trying to wrap everything up. So thanks for being here. Everybody online really appreciates it as well. Um, how about we introduce ourselves? Um, I would love to know uh, more about each of you. I mean, I know all of you, but uh, everyone would love to know more about each of you. Um, so tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, <laughs> emergencies. Um, tell us what team you're on, uh, a little bit about your background, what you're really excited about about the recent releases. Um, yeah, just fill us in on you. Let's start with Maddie. Yes, yeah. hello everybody. Thank you for joining. Um, and thanks for that wonderful intro, Jamie. Uh, I'm Maddie Montequilla, formerly Maddie, Maddie Legere. I just got married. That's why my name changed. I didn't do it for fun. Thank you. Thank you. Um, and yeah, I am a PM on the .NET MAUI team, which is also the Xamarin team. We're kind of doing double duty right now. My focus has been really developer productivity for the past couple of years. So I've been on the team for like three and a half, four years. I was actually an intern at Microsoft when Xamarin got acquired. That's my favorite fun fact. Uh, and my manager at the time was like, oh, they seem cool. And I was like, no. And here we are many years later. But yeah, I love working on .NET MAUI. It's been great uh, getting to be a, a better, bigger part of the .NET ecosystem. So I get to work with all of these people on this side of me even more. <laughs> Yay. Well, thanks for joining us here, Maddie. Um, Matt, how about you? You're next in my list. Sure. Um, yeah, hi, I'm Matt. And um, I'm also a program manager. I um, I'm the lead designer of C-Sharp nowadays, so um, um, I work closely with pretty much all the all the teams. I don't I don't have a real team myself, but we have a, a language design team of people from other teams that join me um, to figure out what's next in C-Sharp. I think I'm the only one who probably gets paid to design C-Sharp full time, so I'm I feel pretty privileged to be here. We all we all think of ourselves as on Team Mads, so, though. Like, <laughs> for sure, go Team Mads. <laughs> Amazing. Thank you for joining us, Mads. Uh, I'm just going to go down my the list here. Uh, Daniel Roth. Oh, that's me. Hi, everyone. I'm Daniel Roth. I'm a program manager on the ASP.NET team. So I work on our web frameworks and, and UI stacks. Um, something you might not know about me, uh, I love Lego robots. I work with a Lego uh, robot team. We just finished our season, and our team actually won our like Lego robot competition this year, which was really great. Go banana bots. Great job. <laughs> uh, yeah, super excited to be here today. Yay. Whoa, banana bots. That's a great name. <laughs> I came up with it. <laughs> I love that. Um, I'll have to ask you about that more, Dan. Um, Kendra. Hi, I'm Kendra. Um, I'm a program manager on the .NET and Visual Studio team, and I uh, do a lot on testing and sometimes things on productivity with uh, Mika Dumont as well. Um, fun thing about me, uh, I, for a while during the Panini, I worked on a car restoration in my living room, uh, which was really fun. We were <laughs> repainting and sanding uh, doors down and stuff of a uh, FJ Cruiser. In and your cruiser. living room? How yes. do you get a it car a into your living room? In parts. Uh, <laughs> One piece at a time, Dan. <laughs> how are you gonna how are you gonna get it out again? <laughs> Through the window. We managed. <laughs> <laughs> Through the roof. <laughs> That's amazing. Oh, you're like our mechanical engineer. We need pictures. <laughs> yes, please send pictures. I can I can send this. <laughs> uh Jeff Fritz. Hey there, friends. My name is Jeff Fritz. I'm a program manager on the .NET community team, and I specialize in helping uh, 
create, present events like this with Jamie and Kendra and some of the other folks here. Um, you, you'll see me creating a bunch of content for for Learn, for Microsoft Learn modules, um, live streaming out there and and creating samples for, for you to check out so you can learn more about Blazor and .NET Maui and some of the other cool tech that, we're, that we've released as part of .NET 6. Um, a, a, a fact, a fun fact that some folks haven't heard about me, I don't know, it, this this is going around a little bit at least, but uh, I, I have a couple horses in, that uh, that we keep here for the uh, for the Fritz family, including one um, a thoroughbred that's that's a little ornery that uh, we like to manage, and my daughter rides in competition. So, oh yeah, I love seeing your your posts about your horses; they're so cute. Um, yeah, Jeff and I uh, are on the same team, community team together. Yep. Uh, next, we have Vincent. Hey, everyone. Uh, my name is Vincent Bai. I'm a bit of the odd one out here because I don't actually work in engineering, but I'm a senior cloud solution architect um, working for the U.S. Midwest region based in the Netherlands. And I help uh, European subsidiaries of our European uh, U.S. customers to be uh, even more successful in Azure uh, in the area of digital and app innovation. Uh, I'm also an Avid uh, Blazor developer, and that led uh, to me becoming part of the Fast Blazor team and uh, bringing out that, that library. And fun fact of me is that I built some uh, open source uh, packages for uh, a CMS system with almost uh, 400,000 downloads. So that was uh, pretty successful. Wow, that's amazing, yeah. Vincent. <laughs> well, thank you so much for joining us. We really appreciate having you here on our panel. Uh, next, we have Luis. Hey friends, uh, I am Luis. I am a content developer working on ML.NET, uh, Azure ML, and .NET for Spark. So I work on the doc side of things. So anything you know related to docs and uh, you know machine learning, uh, big data. You know, so I've, I'm your person there. I'm super excited to be here talking to you folks about you know ML.NET. If you have any questions, I'd love to answer any of those. Um, and I'm originally from the New York, New Jersey area, but today I'm actually coming to you from the Shenandoah Valley area. So, uh, lots of mountains, lots of, uh, farms. So, uh, super complete contrast from the New York, uh, New York city area. So i uh, happy to be here. Oh, amazing. I bet you're loving all that greenery. Yep. <laughs> A little bit different than us here in, uh, the cement jungle of New York city. Um, and last but not least, uh, we have the amazing Scott Hanselman. Mm. Yay. Amazing. <laughs> Maybe no introduction needed. But. You're paid to say that. That's very <laughs> kind. Um, hi, I'm Scott Hanselman, and I work on the .NET and Visual Studio community team. Um, I am on vacation right now, uh, and I am spending my vacation messing with things like um, Meadow, which is a C-sharp on a microcontroller device which is super fun, trying to see how many places I can get C-sharp to run. And uh, my kids are in school right now, so I'm just hanging out and writing code for fun, which is nice. So I wrote, I worked on the Azure Friday website yesterday. And um, a fun fact about me, uh, for the last seven years, I have been uh, managed entirely 24-7 by an open source artificial pancreas, because I'm a type 1 diabetic, and mm -hmm. it is managed in the cloud. Amazing. Amazing. Did you have any um, contributions to that, Scott? I have been a community member for the diabetes community for many, many, many years, and I've had some contributions that were organizational. So I helped organize the some of the things, but I had I didn't actually write the code for the Swift version of that. That was written by a gentleman it named Swift. Nate. Amazing. Well, thank you for taking your holiday uh, to spend it with us here today. Um, I know I really appreciate it. Um, so thank you all for being here. Oh, we have one more. No, I'm just pointing like the Brady Bunch because oh, that's like, what people do. <laughs> we are the Brady Bunch right now. Look at me. Yes, and then uh, so we have everybody here. Uh, we also have a few uh, folks representing um, C++ in the chat. Um, and just because we took questions before doesn't mean that you cannot submit your questions now. Please feel free to do those, uh, to do that throughout the event. Should you have any that pop up, we'll try to get to those uh, at the end once we get through the pre-recorded questions. Um, so, all right, let's take it away.